Hi, Sally Spillane. Hi, Jill Goodman. Daily Planet, Sunday the 2nd of September. Sun is in Virgo, ruled by Mercury. And planets are saying... Mindful is good. <laughs> oh, yeah, planets. Assorted lunars. Yeah, work around that. Okay. While the week of Labor Day can typically be yawn-worthy, since the usual suspects are often elsewhere rather than in their usual lairs, from an astrological standpoint, this particular next week of September could end up being pretty interesting. So rip a page from the Boy Scout manual, and along with being brave, clean, and reverent, be prepared, very prepared. Why? There's just no telling who might turn up with what offer when. In addition, check the reciprocity quotient of a setup before signing on with a flourish. It may be that your expectation of another's contribution or generosity pales in comparison to their expectations of you. And since this is the stuff of which large grudges the approximate size of Africa are frequently made, it would be wise to see whether there are any potential discrepancies at the outset. Finally, apparently specific people aren't exactly willing to admit to errors in judgment or miscalculations, having nothing whatsoever to do with them, that are contributing mightily to the issue at large. Still for a more pleasant interaction all around, if or when they say, but it had nothing to do with me, you probably should refrain from saying, oh yes it did. Mm -hmm. Okay, signs particularly affected by assorted lunars. Virgo, Libra, Gemini, Cancer, Leo. And if one's birthday is 2nd of September. If certain setups, for whatever reason, just aren't doing it for you, how about giving serious thought to why you're still maintaining them and whether you could, if it came to that, live without them? And should the answer be a yes, whether faint or resounding, consider giving them their walking papers. Should the mere idea make you smile, you may actually be onto something. Ah, tomorrow, Daily Planets.